My name is Creatia Spencer. I have three years of full-time teaching. I taught kindergarten for two years and I was a reading specialist for kindergarten through fifth grade for a year. I had two years of substitute teaching from K through 12. I also student taught in grades kindergarten, third grade, and fourth grade. My ideal school is one where the faculty, staff, and administration are work together and support each other in all aspects. The administration is there for the teachers with any problems that, te that might arise. Um, also, the teachers work together as a team to create a safe and fun learning environment for the students. I, as a teacher, I make sh in my classroom, we always work together as a team. We are a team, we are a family. And I make sure that my students feel safe and comfortable in the classroom, that they feel like it's a secure place for them and they want to come to school. Um, in my classroom, the word can't is not allowed. My students can do anything they put their mind to, um, and I make sure they understand that I like, I want them to try it in everything. Um, I tell them that it doesn't have, nothing has to be perfect, but they need to try their best t at everything that we do. Um, my students are always learning and creating in my classroom. Um, creativity is very important. I think that students should be able or should be able to take what they have been learning and to expound on that and to create something new from what they have learned so far in my classroom. Um, I'm all about working as a team in our classroom. We are a big family and teamwork, helping each other is very important to my classroom. A lesson plan that I have taught, or a lesson that I taught that did not go the way I planned was during my first year of teaching. Um, I was teaching my kindergartners subtraction, which is a big, tough concept. Um, in my lesson plan, I used my teacher's manual to come up with the lesson and how I was going to teach it. Um, thought I was really prepared. Thought it was a good lesson. I explained to my students that subtraction means to take a smaller number away from a bigger number. Uh, we wrote a problem on the board, 4 minus 2. I then drew circles on the board to represent the 4 that we had. And we crossed out the 2 that we were taking away so that we can show that we have taken two away. When I asked my students how many were left, many of the students said that there were four because they saw the four on the board. Um, after I finished this lesson and I looked back on it, I thought, I realized my students did not, were not understanding the concept as well. Um, I thought of other ways that I could teach that. And one of the things I realized my students needed to help them learn subtraction better was to be able to touch things and to be able to take, actually take objects away from a pile. Um, so we use many different uh, manipulatives to help them be able to take, to learn subtraction and to take items away. Um, doing this helped, as I continued teaching it, it helped my students to better understand the concept and in the end, they all were able to understand the concept of subtraction. Thank you very much for your consideration.